Nico Hulkenberg says Renault's late double retirement from the Bahrain Grand Prix was brutal, having been on course to finish best of the rest behind Formula One's top three teams. The German had fought his way up to six, which included battling through a war zone of an opening lap, but was robbed of a finish when he suffered an engine problem just after starting his fourth last lap. Teammate Daniel Rochardo stopped at the same corner moments later with a similar unspecified power unit issue. Those events left Renault shell-shocked, and Hulkenberg said he too found it hard to accept a good result had been taken away so quickly, in my mind I had it booked already, he said but it just shows you have to bring it home, over the full race distance, without that, three laps, I was controlling everything. I had a gap to, sixth place finisher Lando, Norris and everything was fine, it came also without any signs or problem before. It just happened from one moment to another, obviously it's a bitter one, hard to swallow. A brutal moment that can happen in racing, but on the positive side we had decent pace in the car today. Just yesterday and today the problems prevented really good results, Hulkenberg managed to charge through the field from 17th on the grid, after surviving what he described as a crazy opening part of the race, lap 1 was like a war zone, he said. It was crazy, there were cars all over the place, contact, sparks, parts flying around, I got a big hit on the helmet from a part as well, everything was in that race. It was a spectacular race to be in, I did a lot of overtaking which was fun. It would have been really nice to reward myself and the team with those points, but we just need to bounce back another time, share this article on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, email.